Hi, this is Shiva Rajaya from vitalcoaching.com. We are talking about vital sex and tantric sex. And the topic for this video is energetic awakening. In this video, I'm going to take a step back and give you the bigger picture about tantric sex. What is this really about? The key words here are energetic awakening, energetic liberation, life transformation, awakening, life optimization, life mastery. We are talking about a plan that is really vast and the way to start activating that energy is through very simple targeted practices. Practices like eye contact or breathing together, sensual touch, conscious intercourse, conscious communication, erotic activation. A lot of these practices are very simple, but the moment you start activating them, you bring a certain form of juice into your life that has a very powerful transformative effect. So the energetic awakening that happens when you tap into sexual energy and you start liberating that force through your system is immense. How it works is that we have in our bodies, in our minds, unlimited sources of energy that are locked in patterns that are not serving us. For instance, you might have a certain sexual conditioning that locks you into believing that pleasure is bad or is shameful, that you're supposed to be quiet when you're having sex, that somehow engaging into any form of self-pleasure practice is a sin, that activating your sexual energy is not honoring your body and your being and your mind. All these misbeliefs or concepts that have been embedded in humankind for a long time it is time to look at them and see what is their value in our existence. Where do they come from? Where are they, these frames originating from? So what I would like you to do is simply check them out and start unwinding, removing the core patterns that no longer serve you. This is not something that I'm forcing on you, okay? It has to be a conscious choice. What is the belief about sex and sexual energy that you want to have inside of you? Sex is bad for me. Sex is good for me. Which one do you choose? I love sex, I don't like sex. I love sex, I hate sex. Which one of those two affirmations will serve you best? I want more pleasure in my life. I want more money in my life. Which one do you choose? Maybe you choose them both. <laughs> But you see, this is a conscious design of what's going on in your mind. You can consciously design your thoughts, your emotions, how you relate to different aspects of your life. So the moment we start engaging into the tantric sex space and we start removing the locks, the energetic locks and blockages that we have concerning our sexual energy, then suddenly there is this overflow of power and bliss and joy 
and the free energy that is going to start impacting on all aspects of your life. So this is what we can call an energetic liberation or energetic awakening. And it's one of the really deep targets of tantric sex is to start tapping into some juice, some energy, which is there all the time. And we tend to not, not use or suppress. So when you are sexually liberated, what happens is that you start entering into an orgasmic state all the time. You start being way happier, way more uh, ecstatic, more blissful. And uh, that state of mind starts impacting on all other areas of your life. You feel happier at work, you feel happier in your couple, happier as a parent. You feel like your body is getting more optimized. You feel like it's more interesting and exciting to go training, to stay in good shape. You feel like more connected with the universe, with the planet, with the gods and goddesses or the energetic invisible powers that are around you. You know, it's a whole lot of uh, powerful benefits and it's a complete path of life mastery by itself. The thing that you achieve or the goal here is life optimization and life mastery. Life mastery is, means that you score high in the 80 to 100 percent range, satisfaction range for all areas of your life. You've got an optimized body, optimized form of feeding yourself, you have an optimized way of relating to others, harmonious relationships, lover, whatever you, you decide in terms of lo love life and sex life. Your mind is optimized. It means that your mind is your best ally. You know how to play with your thoughts, with your emotions, with your feelings. You know how to play with uh, money, how to generate money, how to generate uh, a stable uh, financial life. You know how to create uh, material abundance if you need it. And you know as well how to relate to the planet and the invisible as a whole. It means that you understand your position in the great scheme of things. So this is the big picture. It doesn't concern only tantric sex. It concerns the totality of uh, the, the tantra stream, the tantra system. And uh, many traditions are aimed at exactly that. You go and study, study Buddhism somewhere in the Himalayas. That's what you are going to start tapping into you know, systems that teach you how to optimize your life, how to open up, how to be a better human being, eventually how to reach a state of unity or enlightenment. So this is what tantric sex is about. You know, this is the big picture that we are tapping into when we, um, when we engage into conscious tantric sex practices. It's part of a stream, it's part of a stream of evolution. And um, this is where we are aiming to as a human race. Enjoy.